Pure ice, guys. Pure ice. Like a skating ring. We are guys with you in the forest near our Dachi community. That is the pond where Sheffy used to swim during some period. Now, of course, it looks a little bit different, but in general, also nice. Hello, guys, and welcome to different Russia channel. We get a lot of comments about McDonald's, about fast food chains in Russia. So, in this video, we would like to tell you in details from our, our point of view what we think about fast food chains, what will happen here with fast food chains. So, everything what we think about this question, we will try to explain to you in this particular video. For our new viewers, uh, just a little bit about our family. We live in a small town in Moscow region. It is called Fryazina, about 25 kilometers northeast of Moscow. If you go to Moscow to a big shopping mall or just to some big shopping center, you will definitely find there some food court. McDonald's, Pizza Hut, Kroshka Kartoshka, Burger King, Cinnabon, for example. There are a lot of fast food chains that we have in Russia. And if some of these chains leave our country, definitely we won't be hungry. If you go to some shopping plaza, you will find a lot of restaurants there. And McDonald's is just one of them. If you go, for example, along Mukat, Moscow Ring Road, you will find McDonald's and Burger King. No other food chains can be found on highways. Uh, subway, subway can be at a filling station, for example. Subways are not as popular as Burger Kings and McDonald's, but still, uh, if you stop at some filling station, for example, you can find Subway there. We very seldom go to fast food restaurants. Only if we somewhere in Moscow, for example, we go there uh, for some business and we have to eat something, so we go uh, to a fast food cafe. But usually, guys, I cook everything at home. We eat at home. We seldom go to cafes, to restaurants. So it gives us not just a chance to eat healthy food, because fast food chains usually are not very healthy. And also, we save a lot of money if we cook food at home. Incredibly much money, because you can buy one kilogram of buckwheat and eat it during, I don't know, half a month. And you will pay one dollar for one packet. And you can go to a fast food chain, buy a plate of buckwheat and pay 100 rubles, about one dollar, for the plate. So, to eat at home saves you a lot of money. And besides, your food is much healthier and, in my opinion, much tastier than in fast food chains. So, we go to McDonald's and to other cafes very, very seldom only if you go somewhere. It was convenient for us because if you stop at any McDonald's restaurant, you know what to order, you know what to expect. Um, you, can, you can go to the toilet for free, you can wash hands, so you can, I don't know, take food with you without leaving the car also very convenient mark after so and besides 
McDonald's, McDonald cafes were almost everywhere. Along highways, along smaller roads, in the city, in the suburbs of the city, so almost everywhere. So it was just convenient, just convenient. But we are not going to suffer a lot if some other chain comes and offers approximately something like this, like McDonald's used to give to people, to their clients. That is, guys, the border of our Dutchy community. And over there, we used to have forest, very nice forest. But now, guys, for those who follow us for a long time, over there is just some field at the moment. The forest has gone. Hope not forever. Today, guys, I read some info about the new brand. It will be called Dyadi Vanya and looks like McDonald's. That is the Russian letter V, the first letter of the name Vanya, Dyadi Vanya. Dyadi, that is uncle Vanya, so maybe John, so for you uh, to understand that is some equivalent or how is to say Dyadi Vanya, that is something like Uncle John. So, now they register this brand, Dyadi Vanya. It will look similar to McDonald's and if they provide tasty food, the level of service, уровень обслуживания, so for the majority of people there won't be any difference. Ты пойдешь в кафе Дяди Ваня? Да не принципиально, вкусно, если будет, как бы, нет. why not, if it is yummy, why not go there? Конечно, абсолютно все равно, там, Макдональдс это будет, или Дядя Ваня, или Шурма. Алекс yeah. says it doesn't matter what is the name. The most important thing is yummy and affordable. And yesterday, guys, we went to Globus. Globus is a big store in Щелково. Щелково is the city not far from our town, Фрязино. And from time to time we go there, so we go shopping. And they have a cafe. And yesterday we filmed a small video for you from this cafe. Uh, what is the difference between <laughs> the past times and now? And really, guys, there was some difference, not only in prices, but also some small details that now are a little bit different. That is, guys, the place where we had forest last year and now the field we asked our big boss the head of our dutch community he says here won't be any dutches so sanitarna vyrubka no dutches are planned here on this very place was a big pile of trunks I will insert the picture from here. Huge, really huge mountain of trunks. Now nothing. They took everything. And that is the border of our Dutch community. Oh, guys, look. The new construction. They were lucky to build with old prices. So guys, I hope you liked our small episode. We tried to answer your questions. We tried to explain our uh, point of view. And soon, in a few days, uh, the plan is to go to a big shopping plaza. It is called Biele Dacia. There was Ikea, Obi, I don't know, a lot of boutiques, a lot of uh, foreign shops, uh, and we will show you uh, what is there now, and we will go to a food court, and we'll show you uh, what can we eat when there is no McDonald's.
Okay? So, uh, follow us in Telegram. The link is under the video and also in the first comment. And thank you for watching. Hope, very hope, that YouTube is not closed, is not blocked here. And we will see with you in another video, maybe tomorrow. Обязательно зайдем в Аби. Они уходят и может быть распродажа. Alex says we will go to Obi for sure because Obi is leaving our market and Alex expects some discount on some things. <laughs> да, обязательно зайдем, обязательно посмотрим, все вам покажем. Так yeah. что so, смотрите нас. Hope we will meet with you soon. Bye-bye.